And it has now been three weeks that our area hospitals is over that 15% threshold for patients hospitalized with COVID-19. Covenant Health and UMC are turning to medical tents to handle this surge. We first told you about this last night, but today we're going to look inside these tents. And Laura Lawhead joins us now. And Laura, you got a tour of this tent today. Lauren, I did, and they are calling this the COVID Infusion Center. And construction began on it yesterday and continues now if you take a look behind me. From the outside, it doesn't look too frightening, but on the inside, it looks like a field hospital from a scene of MASH. And starting next week, dozens of doctors and nurses will be in here treating our latest coronavirus patients. And with our growing number of cases, our hospitals need all the help they can get. As the sick rush to our hospitals from across the region, medical workers getting creative to weather the surge. It's a huge strain on our hospital systems. Take a look inside the future of health care in the pandemic. Covenant Health constructing this mobile medical tent to create 14 new beds for treating coronavirus patients. If we can intervene early enough in the virus process, then maybe they don't have to get admitted inside of our hospitals. But it's not for patients with critical cases. They'll stay in the ICU. It's for those with milder cases to stop the virus in its tracks before it lands them in the ER. They're going to get uh, antiviral therapy. We're even looking at some of the newer experimental medicines. The goal is to reduce the number of incoming COVID patients by 20 percent and help ease the burden on our doctors and nurses who are coming down with the virus too. We're having to use a whole lot more staff every time we treat one of these patients. Health experts reminding us once again to be on our guards. You might feel fine, but you don't want to put a loved one in the hospital. We as a society have to kind of start taking a little bit of personal responsibility about how we interact with each other, how we take care of our family, because you know, you don't want to be that person who's getting everybody else sick. The tent will be up and running early next week, and Covenant said it will start registering patients for it soon. UMC also beginning construction on their own tent today, and we'll keep you updated on their progress right here on KMAC News and on everythinglubbock.com. Reporting from the Covenant Medical Center, I'm Laura Lawhead, KMAC News. Laura, we